Hi, I'm Rich at New Life Scientific, and today I'm going to talk about the Virtus freeze dryers a little bit, especially the, the smaller to the bigger ones, and kind of wanted to give you a, a little bit of an idea how to scale up from your laboratory. So when you're, you know, when you're doing small scale and you want to step up the production to get a little closer to full production, um, we're going to just look at a few machines here that uh, Virtus has enabled you to do that. And also we're going to talk about the controller on it too. And through, you know, the last 20 years, Virtus has kind of, kind of stepped up their control systems to different types and they've went from PLC units. And then they kind of ended up with the uh, Wizard 2.0 um, control panel, which is a very friendly uh, system to quick program and to save some programs. And uh, they also have a computer version that you can hook up to it and pre-program some some uh, recipes in it but I want to talk first about um, scaling up um, we have two pretty nice size units here on the floor we also have a bench top unit which is the advantage unit and that one there is uh, one that we do have I think but I didn't want to bring it on the floor and we'll shoot we'll, we'll actually insert a photo here of that but the advantage is just a a little bit smaller than the Genesis as far as the capacity inside your um, freeze drying chamber here. Um, this one, this particular unit actually has, I believe, five shelves in it, which allows you to, you know, get up a little bit more production um, rather than the, the Advantage model. But, and this one has a lot more capacity as far as the condenser also. This one's a 25 liter capacity where the bench top has a very little capacity. You're gonna have to stop and defrost. Um, this one here, you can really pack it in and you got a lot of room to pull down all, uh, um, all the moisture out. But this is basically the next step up from the Advantage. Um, what's really nice is, like I said, the Wizard 2.0 control panel is the same control panel that's used in the Advantage, it's used in the Genesis, and then it's used over here in the Ultra, which we're going to move over in a little bit and look at the Ultra. But that's what's really nice. When you have recipes and you just want to save a recipe and move it over to the next machine and just install it into that, it's just saving it and, and uploading it right to the next machine. So if you want to actually step up your game. But like I said, it's, uh, it's just straightforward. There's a few things that perhaps you can't do that you could with, with the newest and greatest version. But simplicity is what I find a lot of lab... Uh, techs really like and you know just having something simple straightforward and uh, I'm going to step over here to the ultra model here you can see the ultra has just got a load of shelves in it and this one actually has the stop ring built into it so it has a hydraulic cylinder in the bottom same way as this one this one has stop ring it actually has a hydraulic cylinder in the top coming down this one has a hydraulic cylinder in it, and it's just pushing all the shelves up and clamping all your samples in there and um, keeping them like it is stoppered. So this one also has up to eight different uh, channels to read your temperatures your, in your product down here on the shelves. And then also the Wizard 2.0 gives you the capability to read up to eight different channels. So this is the one that steps up to about the end of the lab use where you would go into full production. Um, this one here has actually, this one is one that we converted over and upgraded it to the Wizard 2.0 control panel. This one was run by the older PLC units that they had that they've actually discontinued. And we've completely refurbished this one and updated the whole control panel, um, went through the refrigeration in it so that it's ready to go for many more years. But one thing I like about Virtus is when they build them, they build them solid and they build them to last a long time. Everything is industrial grade in these units. So refurbishing them and keeping going for many more years is an easy option to do on these versus buying a brand new one. But like I said, we've gone through this one and um, it has the big swing open door on this one that gives you plenty of room just to get in and fill up all the trays and like i said it's plenty of room in there 
plenty of room in the condenser. You can run this for days on end with no problem and freeze drying a lot of samples in there. Um, but like I said, the, the, the last one would probably be this one to step up to full production scale. But we have both of these and we are now converting these ultras over to the new 2.0. Um, uh, it's um, just as simple as cutting out a slot in the front panel, inserting the control panel, and then doing all the wiring and hooking it back up to replace the older system. And it works great. This is, like I said, a, a nice system to work with. Once you get used to it, you don't have to change it. You can just upgrade and go to the next system. But we are very knowledgeable on the vertices, especially um, the line that you see here and we have them in stock we have them ready to go so if you're interested we have the genesis we have the ultra we have another ultra coming up um, so if you have any questions on these give us a call here at new life scientific and i'll be happy to answer any questions thank you for watching